determinant of a matrix singular and non singular so how do you know given determinant is a singular and non singular now example simple is very simple matrix a means determinant of a is a given a1 a2 a3 second row b1 b2 b3 third row c1 c2 c3 this is one determinant okay now expand this determinant you take determinant means like this now expand this determinant now you get determinant of a equal to 0 that is called a it is a singular this is very simple expand this determinant you get determinant of a equal to 0 that is a singular suppose determinant of a is not equal to 0 that determinant is a non singular that's all it's very simple okay next minor and cofactor of a element now consider one determinant that determinant is given like this a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 c1 c2 c3 okay now taking minor of a2 is now taking this element the minor of a2 is that is called capital a2 except first row and second column means consider only these elements b1 c1 b3 c3 that is a b1 c1 b3 c3 okay that means it's very simple cofactor of a2 is that is a2 okay this is a2 and this is equal to minus 1 hold hold to i plus j so i am taking i plus j uh, sorry a2 is equal to minus 1 plus 2 1 plus 2 so I am taking minus 1 plus 2 1 plus 2 first row second column that means it is mentioned if the element is in the ith row this is ith row i1 i2 i3 like this ith row and jth column column wise like this jth column it is allocated or denoted by minus 1 rest to i plus j like this i means row j means column consider this second a2 element first row means 1 second column means 2 minus 1 rest to 1 plus 2 now taking these elements means same determinant b1 uh, c1 b3 c3 and this is a minus 1 holds to 1 plus 2 is a 3 minus 1 holds to 3 means again minus sign and b1 c1 b3 c3 now expand this determinant you get minus values adjoint and inverse of a matrix of a okay now the matrix is given matrix a is a given like this a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 c1 c2 c3 okay now following this method cofactor of all elements a1 cofactor of a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 c1 c2 c3 now we get cofactor matrix is cofactor matrix is Cofactor of A1 is capital A1. Cofactor of A2 is A2. Cofactor of A3 is A3. And this is B1, B2, B3, C1, C2, C3. Okay. These are cofactors of A1, A2, A3, B1, B2, B3, C1, C2, C3. Now you find adjoint first. Okay. Now adjoint is. adjoint of matrix A is equal to adjoint of matrix A is equal to row become column 
or column become row this is row is become a1 a2 a3 and second row is a second column b1 b2 and b3 third row is a third column c1 c2 c3 this is a adjoint of a next is inverse matrix inverse matrix is very simple now inverse of a is equal to adjoint of a this adjoint of a divided by determinant of a okay actually determinant of a means non singular inverse of a is equal to adjoint of a divided by determinant of a 